This video is a continuation of the Easily Make These Interiors Enterable in Main World. I am working in meters as scene units. Isolate the objects with ALTQ. Notice the frame rate jumps up drastically. Select by material and delete the entry box. Select everything and snap the interior door to the exterior door for reference. Hide one of the doors. Untick backface culling for the exterior. Hide the roof polygons. Remove the two black planes that separate the house. Remove the cement ceiling inside of the house. Select the top vertices of the interior. And move down by minus 0.605. This is necessary because the roof clips through the interior. You could also try using booleans to change the shape of the ceiling to match the roof, but that would perhaps look worse. Move down the three overhead lamps at second floor by minus 0.71. Select the two DFX lights above the overhead lamps and move down by the same amount. Select the front wall vertices with the window and move minus 0.15. Add an edit poly to the exterior named Roof Fix. Merge the sand colored tiles back into the walls. There will be some overlapping vertices and poor UVs, but you can fix that quite easily if desired. Ladies and gentlemen, we got them. Add an edit poly to the exterior named second floor ceiling fix. With axis constraints enabled, select the cement floor at the front porch and detach as clone to element. And drag and snap to the top of the walls. Flip the normals so it faces the camera. There are a few tweaks that you can make near the door, which includes fixing some Z-fighting polygons and such, but to keep this guide short, I won't fix it. Select everything and export to IPL. In the IPL, add inst to the top and end to the end, and change the door to gen underscore door in T01 and to ID 1491. The incorrect IDs will be fixed automatically later in this video. Copy and move the door to 000. Press Z to focus the object and clear out the rotations. Create a box around the door and name it door underscore coal.
and two spheres that intersects the right side of the door, which is the side that the player needs to hit for the door to open. I made them 0.42 in radius. Export Collision Export DFF The door is meant to replace ID 1491. Set up the TXD by creating a copy of ext underscore doors underscore old dot TXD from GTA 3.IMG and deleting the two unused textures. Export the exterior DFF and interior DFF. When exporting the interior, make sure to also select the Omni lights that are linked to the model. Open the original interior DFF with RW Analyze. Right-click Clump and Collapse Child Sections. Click Geometry List, Geometry, Extension, and Export 2DFX section to a file and name it 2DFX without any file extensions. If you don't see anything named 2DFX, watch this video that shows how to add custom sections to the tool. Open the custom DF. Right-click Clump and Collapse Child Sections. Click Geometry List, Geometry Extension, and Add Section Set to 2DFX. Import Section Data, which is the 2DFX file you exported few moments ago. Save. In Scene Explorer, click Layers. Select and isolate Carl's Crap underscore Cole and Vertex Selection Mode Remove Isolated Vertices Delete the Entrance Box Vertices Select the top vertices of the interior and move down by minus 0.605. Select the front wall vertices with the window and move minus 0.15 along the Y axis. Export Collision Select and isolate Carl's Who 1 underscore LAE2 underscore Cole and Carl's How 1 underscore LAE2 DFF. Clone the DFF and move it a bit closer to the collision. In Vertex Selection Mode, remove isolated vertices. Hide the roof polygons. Remove the long rectangular collision box. Delete the two polygons on the inside of the house. Move the DFF onto the collision location. Use the Cut tool to remove part of the ground on the inside of the collision.
Use the slice plane tool to remove part of the side by the entrance. Delete the other polygon in front of it. With axis constraints, extrude the wall by the door frame. Delete the ceiling at the front porch. Select the floor at the front porch and detach as clone to element. Move up 2.7. Flip the normals so it faces the camera. Unhide the roof. Border select the borders between the top walls and the roof and bridge to fill the gap. Unhide the primitive boxes if they were hidden and export collision. Convert the IPL map to Lua map so that it can be loaded on MTA. Add the following code to the Lua script to remove original object and its LOD from map.